An island, a girl, maps, magic, an adventure, and a comedy chicken. The Girl of Ink and Stars is about Isabella Rios, who is the daughter of a map maker, and all she wants is to see the rest of her island. And she's got this real adventurous spirit, but she's never been able to do anything about it because her island is ruled by the governor and he won't let anyone see outside Gromera, which is the village that Isabella lives in. So what she does instead is she gets her dad to tell her stories and she goes on adventures around the village with her friend Lupe. But inside there's this deep, deep desire to just go out and see what the rest of the island holds. They say the day the governor arrived, the ravens did too. All the smaller birds flew backwards into the sea, and that is why there are no songbirds on Joya, only huge, ragged ravens. I didn't really want to be a writer up until four years ago. All I wanted to do was read as many books as possible. And then I sort of started writing by accident, and now I can't imagine doing anything else. Isabella really desperately wants to believe in magic, but she's not really being given any evidence to see that it exists. She loves hearing her dad's stories and she desperately wants there to be something more to the world around her. Because she's so receptive to myths and, and so on, she's the one who spots all the clues and nobody else puts it together until it's far too late. Why did the songbirds leave Dar? I'd ask. Because they could, Isabella. And the wolves? The deer? Dar's face would darken. I hope that my readers will enjoy the characters, watching the characters grow. I'm hoping that they'll be excited by the world um, and the joy in landscape and also be scared in parts. That would be good. <laughs> chose the title The Girl of Ink and Stars because I thought it was a good description of Isabella. You know, she's a dreamer. She does always think, have her head in the clouds, and she's always thinking, you know, what's beyond the horizon. I refused to say any more about the wolves and the backwards birds. But I kept asking until the day came when I found my own answers.